Hey, it's Dominic Davis from the Hermit Crab Vlog, and today I'm going to show you one of my Hermit Crabs. This is my jumbo size Hermit Crab. Um, hermit Crabs have their own personality. His personality is kind of bossy because he's he's really bossy to other Hermit Crabs. He makes other Hermit Crabs um, move out of the bridge. Like um, there would be on um, like a couple of medium sized Hermit Crabs under the bridge and then he just comes in to, and like um makes them come go out of the bridge for him for, for him to fill under it's kind of mean but um, but he's a jumbo and i i kind of expect that from him he's kind of um he's really active for a hammer crab and he's like, you know, like, he's really good. Kind of, kind of bigger than my hand, but he's really good. I got him from All Pets Club in Bearden. They saw jumbles there. And I was like, wow. I was like, he switched shells. He used to be inside the shell. Probably the kids. He used to be inside like this show when I first got him. Um, as you can see, I have like mother of pearl lining. It's really, um, I don't know why they have shells. Why they would actually have sh pick these shells. I think they forced them inside. A hermit crab would never pick the shell. It won't really, if I'm reaching inside of it and his abdomen couldn't really, can't, couldn't really fit. Like, this shell, this shell versus this shell. This shell, this shell wins because his abdomen can um, fit all the way. And it's kind of like a light shell. It's kind of like a big shell. Like, mother pro lining. This also has mother pro lining in it. But this one, this this one's better, cause he can fit all the way inside. I kind of understand why he switched shells. He it's kind of thin on, on the back, so he can't really put his abdomen inside. Of it. So this was my jumbo size hermit crab. His name is Kermit, and this was the hermit crab block. But before I I get, I can tell you, I'm gonna. If, before I can do anything else, my next video I'm making today is gonna it's gonna be about my hermit crab tank because I added sand inside of it, the yellow sand. It's not toxic. It's for it's reptile sand, but it's it's still good for them. I didn't get enough. I'm gonna kind of try to buy one each week to get as high as the dirt level. But the dirt level is huge now because I piled it up onto each other now he can um actually fit under now because before he couldn't yeah he couldn't yeah there's gonna, there's gonna be dirt um above him and dirt underneath him that's, that's good so this was the hermit crab blog hope you like it and my name is Dominic Davis and check out my videos subscribe leave comments below I'll answer them and good luck on your new hermit crab or if you don't have a new hermit crab but just good luck Peace out, dudes.